Hey, welcome back to But I Won't Do That. We have a weekly podcast, John. Absolutely, we do, and it's pretty special. We've been kicking around for a while talking about song lyrics, and tonight is no different. We're going to do it again? Again. More song lyrics? Oh, oh fantastic. Can you think of anything better to do? On a Monday night? No. Okay. I'm, uh, this is brilliant. Hey, but it's Saturday morning. American Top 40. Hi, I'm Casey Kasem, and welcome to American Top 40. Have we, have we got the wrong podcast? What? Have we got the wrong podcast? Are you saying I'm not Casey Kasem? I, I don't know, I've just turned up to a podcast and you're Casey. from coast to coast. Which coast? Or a toast? Toast to toast? Ghost to go. Ghost to go. Oh, that's more like it. Yeah, we were ghosts at, at the end of our last podcast. We were ghosts. We were all spooky, hiding in the corner of your land room. Yeah. So if you haven't listened to our last podcast, it was the one before this one. That was the um, the Halloween have a, have a, podcast. No, it wasn't. No, I. We just turned into ghosts. I am going on the record right now to tell all of our listeners, and I don't care if it, I don't care if this offends anybody. Actually, I hope it offends some people. You ready? Yeah, what is I it? hate Halloween. You hate it? I'm not into it. I'll tell you why I, I hate it. I'll mm-hmm. tell you why I hate it. Number one, it's American BS. Mm-hmm. Right? And people go, oh, don't you know anything, man? You're so ignorant. It started in Ireland. And Whatever. I don't care. It's American BS, right? You're allowed to not like it. I'm de- I'm, I haven't even finished. Oh, yet. my goodness gracious me. Yeah, I don't like it. And... The other reason I don't like it, there's two more reasons. Mm -hmm. Number one of those two reasons, apart from being American, and I think Mm -hmm. a lot of Americans, and we do have listeners in America as well, our listeners in America are fine. Yeah. If you're in America and you're doing Halloween, good on you, man. It's American. Go for it, man. Red, white, and blue. Be American. It's great. (laughs) Um, But this is Australia, and we don't do Halloween in Australia. Stop trying to be like America. America. It's just companies cashing, cashing in, in. Yep. The with people. plastic, big old plastic skeleton heads. And that's number three. And ugh. all the plastic waste. Mm-hmm. I'm an environmentalist, but I don't like the amount of plastic waste that comes out of Halloween. It's cheap shit that's bought from Kmart. I hate it. I stand against it because you have to stand for something. You've got to stand against something. I stand against Halloween. Can you imagine all the fake skeletons that will go into landfill? And then, so, so what can you imagine that? that? Fake skeletons go to landfill, right? Like the same skeletons. Meteor hits the earth. Yeah. Thousand years later, mankind somehow finds its way back, digs a hole, and then the scientists at the time surmise, quite rightly, that we were made of plastic. Absolutely. Yeah. It's going to be very confusing in the future. <sighs> Just How think, dare they? Just think, How dare we? Think generationally, people. You know, you don't want future generations of post-apocalyptic, post-revelation sort mm. of people digging up plastic skeletons and wondering why they're made of bone. And some of those skeletons are very, very tiny and on yeah. elastic. Yeah. They're going to be very confused. Humans are both six inches tall yeah. and six human-sized. Inches. Yeah. And some of the, have you seen some of the sizes of the plastic uh, skeleton heads? No. What, like elephant size heads. This one had Massive. a head like a carved pumpkin, they'll be saying. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's like, like, what kind of human was this? No, it's pumpkin, a pumpkin head. That's why I hate it. Yeah. That's no, that's fair. Because of did... future problems yeah. in a thousand or a million years. And also... And that's fair. Reason number... And everyone wore <laughs> witch costumes. You're stupid. I know. Just stupid. Reason number 94 that I hate it... Yep. Is... We have a dog that we... Murphy's been on this podcast before. And it was... To be time. fair, that was probably the best podcast we've ever done. With Murphy? With Murphy, yeah. yeah. Murphy shone. It Absolutely was, shone. Which is much better than what he did earlier that also started with SH that I thought you were going to say. Oh. Yeah, because he also does a bit of poopies. Anyway. We, we were sitting down for dinner. The dog had settled... And then, we don't have our house decorated or anything like for Halloween, and little children dressed in not very creative costumes, like 
school uniform and a mask, right? Yeah. Yeah. T- knocking at the door. I mean, and who's knocking at the door? If I, maybe it's one of my neighbours coming to bring me a nice, fresh lettuce from his vegetable garden. Yes. Or maybe yeah. a lawyer saying, yeah, cease and desist yeah, or from he, what you're doing in the garden on yeah. a regular basis at midnight when the moon is full. Oh. Yeah, you do need to stop that, by the way. Sorry. It's really weird. Kids, trick or treating. Oh. I, man, we had to very... Because you can't now. You can't say to the kids, you can't go, oh, bugger off, you little bastards. Piss off. You can't say that because they get really? offended. You get offended, the next thing you know... That's dad, what I'm doing wrong. Dad comes around, what did you say to my kids? Uh, tell them to piss off. You know. Your kid's like, like 30. Yeah. Dressed as Iron Man. That's right. And people get out get of here. Yeah. Right? So, yeah, sorry, darling. We're not... We actually do. I have to explain why I've decided to be a normal person. Mm-hmm. Anyway. It's I'm, a travesty, mate. It's I'm a travesty. It's a travesty. It's a ranting. That's right. You, I'm using Grant, my Grant, you can rant. It's called Grant. Use your platform. You know what? Maybe we can get Halloween cancelled. I'm neither here nor there, but you know what? Because um, I, I really don't care about Halloween. Yeah. But um, maybe we could just get it cancelled. I'm in, I'm in it for fun. Yeah. I'll cancel it for funsies. Let's do it. Yeah. I'm cancelling Halloween. You're cancelling Halloween? Yeah. I'm cancelling Easter. Oh, you can't do that. Yeah. No. Yeah. No, because you know I'm a Christian. You can't do that. <laughs> Yeah. No, it matters to me, man. Halloween was originally uh, Christian-based. I, said, was I just taste. said wankers will say that. Yeah, and I'm a wanker. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Right, so I, I, no, that's all right. We won't, I'm going to cancel um, the, queen, the Queen's birthday. Ramadan. The Queen, we're not celebrating. Oh, no, she's dead. We can't do that. Too You'd realise we're going to celebrate the King's birthday. I'm oh. 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 I don't care. Day off. So don't if care. You, can, you can't hear this, John, but there's a fan going in the background right now that yep. I can't turn off. Yep. So our beauties right now are listening to the cooling fan on my Mac because Fantastic. the microphone is right above the yep. Mac. Yep. We're, we're two guys, one mic these days. Oh, my goodness. I know. Um, and so I'm really sorry about that very soft noise. Just That soft hum. Treat it as an ASMR video. It sounds like um, a gentle stream at the end of the garden. Think of it like that. It actually sounds like a jet engine warming up on the <laughs> toilet. Well, the stream at the end of my garden does happen to sound like a jet engine warming up. But anyway, uh, well, so that's all right. That's why you pay more rent. Yeah, yeah absolutely. That's why I pay rent. Oh. So I don't have a mortgage. A mortgage. I'd love a mortgage. But, um, Go get one. I'd love to get one. Go get one now. I might get one one day. Go get one now. Can't afford it. Oh. Can't afford a mortgage. But you can afford rent. They won't give me a mortgage. No? I don't have a deposit. Oh, you didn't have a deposit? I don't have a deposit. I don't earn enough would you to like, have a deposit. Would you like me to give you deposit? I would love a deposit. I will do do you have a, a spare deposit lying yeah. around? I, I could make you a deposit. This is not racist because it is not any particular accent. No, it's a mix of accent. It's a mix. We are offending everybody. Let's see how many wrestlers we can offend. Yes, we will offend lots of people with this accent. What Everybody. Do we, what do we do on this podcast? I have... Oh, you know what we do? So, why do we... We do talk about the music. <laughs> so, why don't we just do that? <laughs> it, uh, it escalated. Eight minutes and 40 seconds later. Well, it started with you ranting know, about... Halloween. Halloween. And I then know. we escalated into offending every country in the world. So... Sometimes at primary schools, to get kids back in from recess, they play songs instead of ringing the bell. Did you know this? No, I did not know this. They do. They try and pick positive, uplifting songs that are happy and want to get the kids sort of dancing back to class, right? This song we're doing tonight is one of those. Really? So it's a song that schools, primary schools, choose... And it's some it's at weddings and it's like a happy, uplifting, positive sort of song. We do positive, only positive stuff in in this podcast. Only, really, there's nothing questionable. There's nothing negative ever, ever, right? ever. Nothing questionable. We nothing would not disparage anybody nothing, except anybody from Finland. Nothing but anyway, brought into it at all. Nothing. Right? Yeah. So it's recess. Playing over the speakers, you're out there playing. I'm a little boy, I'm at school. Marbles. How old am I? Eight. I'm eight and I'm playing marbles. Oh, I'm playing marbles and I'm eight years old. The speaker starts to crackle. Oh. Oh, my little pretty one. 
pretty one. Wait, what? Yep. Is that me? Am I the pretty one? I don't know. Oh. You just know it's time to get back to class. Oh, my little pretty one. Okay. All right. Hold on. Hold on, lads. Hold on to your marbles. I think we might have to go in. Hold on. What's going to happen now? When are you going to give me some time, Sharona? Wait, hold on a minute. Who's Sharona? Sharona, it's her over there. Her over there. Has she got a time machine? How's she going to give me time? The one with the the, the young lass with no neck. The one with no... That's Sharona. Yeah. Or Sharon A. Sharon A. Yeah. Yeah, Sharon A, as opposed to Sharon B and Sharon C. Yeah, that's right. That's right. And how's she going to give it? Has she got a time? Has she got a flux capacitor? Has she uh, been working in science class on her flux capacitor, and now she's going to give me some time? Because to be honest, I would like the eighties back if I'm honest. I was going. Oh no, sorry, I'm a little boy. I was going to tell you a joke about time. Tell me. Sometime. I, I learned it from my watch, though, so it's a second-hand joke. Hang on, so, a, hang on a tick. <laughs> so. No. So so Sharon A is yeah. going to give me some time. Some time. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and to answer all of your questions, yes, she has a flux capacitor. Yes, she has a banana skin and some beer to put in the Mr. Fusion part. Uh, the back of her flux, uh, back of her DeLorean to power the, 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 the time circuits for the flux capacitor. Fantastic. And she's going to get us up to 88 miles per hour. Great, Scott. That's heavy. Brilliant. Yep. Hey, this song is uh, is a brilliant success so far. Yep. I love it. So, All right. Back to the DeLorean. Back to the DeLorean. All right, here we go. Oh, you make my motor run. My motor Re- run. Oh, you said that twice. Oh, sorry, I, I... Did it Did it no, not? I didn't say it twice. Oh. I said it once, then went back in time, then came back instantly, but a half a second that after. That makes... Perfect yeah. sense. If yeah. you've got a DeLorean, of course you can do that. Yeah. And you've put extra emphasis on yeah. Sharon Sharon A yeah. making your motor run. Yes. So well, how long is she a mechanic as well? Because no, she's no, making she's your motor. Nine. She's not yeah. maybe she's a genius. But she's lived nine lifetimes as well. So there's a lot you don't know. There's this song's a lot amazing. Pa- lot to unpack about this song's a, I thought this was just an innocent little song. Turns no. out no. no. Alright, alright. Gunning it gun it coming off the line, Sharona. So Sharon A is now a racing driver. Oh, sorry, I might have put the emphasis on the wrong syllable. Oh, no. Yeah, she is a racing driver, but we're going to talk about that in our next podcast. Yeah. So when you say gun it, you don't mean like she's got an AR-15. You mean she's, no, she's hitting that accelerator pedal. If she, if she, so if she had a metal foot, she'd put the metal to the pedal to the metal. Yeah, like, nice. Yeah, yeah. She's, she's all about... But you know, she's so like, she's in the DeLorean and she's just hoofing it. <laughs> gun it coming, <gasps> gun it coming off the line, Sharon A. Yeah. She is about to time travel. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, she has to get it up to eighty miles an hour. Fantastic. I don't know, Doc, you made a time machine <laughs> out of a DeLorean. I, look, I'm imagining a clock tower. Yeah. I'm imagining uh, a dog yeah. inside her. She's yeah. wearing a life preserver. <laughs> you know, she's wearing a, a puffer jacket. Um, Different from uh, Marty McFly, but you know what? I mean, who's Marty McFly? What? I don't even know what's that. Don't know what you're talking about. It's Sharona, Sharon A. You on all the other stuff? Maybe Sharon B and Sharon C. They're different Sharons at a different time. But let's not go there. John. Yeah. You're my density. (laughs) (laughs) I don't get the reference. I'm just laughing. (laughs) Don't you get the reference? No. The same. No, I don't remember. I I haven't seen it in a long time. I'm look. I'm just happy with where we're at. Anyway, in Spain, stays mainly on the plane. I'm never going to stop. Wait, what? I'm never going to stop. You have to. That's I'm why cars are brakes. I'm never going to stop. Okay. Yeah, give it up. All right. Such a dirty mind. Oh, that turned a corner. Yeah, I always get it up for the touch of a younger kind. Oh! Get Hold on a mind. minute. They play this at primary school? Yes. Whoa! Yeah. I thought it was about time travel and then it got a bit weird. Do you know what song it just reminded me of? A song that I'd love to do actually. Have you ever heard the song? Whoa, jump in my car. I want to take you home. Yes, I have heard that song. Yeah. You know what? If only we had a podcast that covered songs. We could cover it one day. We We could could talk about it. You know what? Let's do a podcast that covers songs. Let's or let's find act- people that have a podcast that covers songs and they can do it. Let's find people that used to have a podcast covering songs and we can time travel back to them yeah. and, and go on their podcast and... And do the song. song. Maybe, Maybe that's, that's why, why, that's why you always get it up for the touch of a younger kid. kid. Oh, what? <laughs> a younger kind. I love it. That's brilliant. That's a great idea. What a concept. To, you wouldn't want a typo there, actually, would you? No. The touch of a younger kid. My. Well, my, it does say a touch of the younger kind. Kind, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. 
So these next lyrics here okay. describe what's happening in the DeLorean. Okay. My, 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 I, yay, woo! <laughs> wow, that sounds exciting. <laughs> That's how, that was quite the climax. M- 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 my Sharona. That you get, you're repeatedly going back in time. My Sharona. Yeah, your Sharona. Like, Am I only, glitching? Yeah, you Am are I glitching. glitching. That's a that's a product of time travel. Don't it worry. Is? Yeah, it's Shit. a product. You glitch when you time travel. Do you not notice that? Do I not? Notice Whenever that? you time travel, you glitch. Do I? Yeah, every time. <sighs> try try the line again. M- 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 my Sharona. Yeah, you did it again. Again, because yeah. for me, I'm just saying. M- 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 my Sharona. Like, I understand naturally. you're trying to say my Sharona, but no, yeah. you are definitely glitching. And it's about the time trip. Don't worry, it's the DeLorean. It's yeah. the DeLorean. It's old tech. It's old tech. I knew I Your flux capacitor's got a bit of air in it. Ah. That's probably what it is. We'll have to bleed. The, write it down. Bleed the lines. Bleed the lines of the flux capacitor. Yeah. Maybe um, the your Mr. Fusion needs another banana skin. I don't get that reference. You don't? Oh, well. <laughs> Great Scott. Uh, come a little closer, huh? A will ya, huh? Wow, that's an interesting line. That was that's a terribly written Could line. Could you imagine being the songwriter? So he's gone. He he, he go, He's written a bit like the the my but 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 my Sharon a bit, and he's like, come a little closer. I'm going to bed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then he can't sleep, so he has some um, benzodiazepine. Yep. Or something. Yeah. You know whatever. And then he has a bit of a sleep, but then he gets up at two. Mm-hmm. And he writes the rest of the line, which is, huh, huh, will you, huh? And then he gets up in the morning and he reads it back and he's like, whatever. I'm what the heck was that? Whatever. I am well and he had a it, like, He had a 2 a.m. stroke of yeah, genius yeah, and yeah. realised he just oh, yeah, had a 2 stroke. stroke. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's some weird songwriting. So, Somebody but, wrote that. So come a little closer. Huh? Huh? Will you? Huh? 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 Well, that's very Marty McFly. Huh? What? Huh? Ah, yeah, it is. It is. Yeah. This is such a time travel song. Who's Marty McFly? I don't know. Yeah, just for the lawyers. I'm just putting that one in. Oh yeah, lawyers. yeah. So, uh, so whoever the corporation is who owns yeah. that movie, don't oh, come after. Hang us. on, don't we own? Doesn't Beauty Corp own Back to the Future now? Don't do we own one and three, or do we just own two? I thought we owned all of them. <clears throat> we do own all of them, now. including four, which hasn't even been which made. Has, well, that's, hmm. Well, it's in the future, yeah, which we own anyway. Yeah, which we own the future. It's the time. Well. It's we we do have the time travel department, which mm. is on level five. That's a very sensible level. <laughs> Normally we go like twenty eight, thirty two. <laughs> yeah, yeah. like what do we do on the lower that? levels? Time travel time, department. Time travel department. Yeah, because it was one of the first things that we did at Beauty Corp. So we did the yeah, absolutely. Baby and that's movies. when we that's when we went back in time and locked down the Back to the Future movies. That was when we went back and got Tom Cruise to sign that contract earlier. And why we have him and Brad Pitt and yeah. Beckham and a few of the others working for us now. Yeah, because yeah. because we locked them into contracts when yeah. they were not that famous. Because yeah. people wonder how we how we are so rich and wealthy, and we do have very famous people working for us. It's because mm. we signed them up. Back then, when, when they were 17, 18, and they thought, well, this doesn't, this won't ever amount to anything. Yeah. And look where we are look now, now, doing a podcast about music in Hobart. In, Boom. In my rumpus room. Yeah, absolutely. People wouldn't believe it. No. People won't believe what, would, how we do this. Yeah. After this, do you want to do, do you want to just sit around counting money after this? Oh, man, I haven't got time for that. Just, That's going to take ages. You haven't it got It took what? us three weeks. You haven't like, got what? To- <gasps> oh, yes, we do have listen. time. You know what? Yes, let's do it. Let's do Brilliant. It. All right. A billion and oh, hold one. On. A billion and two. <laughs> I just started a billion. I two got, billion. I just got that pile of billions. So I just count by piles of billions. Yeah, no, that's fair enough. That's, it, that's You know what? That's the efficient way to do it. So come I'll a little closer. Yep. Close enough to look in my eyes, Sharon A. Eh? You there? Oh, he wants, a, he wants a close up. Do you want a mint? There's nothing wrong. Yeah, sorry about that. Gosh, Sharon. Ooh. What have you been eating? Have you been eating tuna? Sharon A. Oh, Sharon yeah, a. I think she's been eating tuna and onions. Tuna Sharon. and onions. Oh, she smells... She she sounds like a smelly girl. Yeah, she does. <laughs> Sharon oh. A. Smelly. Put that on a t-shirt. Keeping it a mystery gets to me. Oh, well, it is a mystery. Yeah. I mean, time travel is a mystery. I've got to give him that. Yeah, that's what... It, it is a it real mystery. Mis- it, it, running down the length of my thighs... Sharon. Oh, has he had an accident? Is is he had a, he has <laughs> had a little wee? It gets he, to me. He, That's how it gets to me. Like so, he so weed himself. Just like gluten. 
Yeah. It's just like gluten. It just gets to me. Oh, are you saying yeah. you? Oh, you're more, more of a brown trousers um was running, situation. Huh? Running down the. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah I, I do love that part of whiz. Huh? You do. You do it very well. One You've done it your whole life. It's a public one. You do it. Huh? Yeah, <laughs> one in Dublin. Everyone, every, when you when you're in an elevator, any time I do the yeah. one, people look around. Yeah. It's like if because if you go, <laughs> or hang on, what's it, Ellen? Yeah, it no, sounds it, obvious. They say, but <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's like when you've tried to hold in. From the beginning of the song, we agreed I was eight, and then <laughs> I'm laughing at that proves I'm eight years old. Yes. Huh? Yeah, this song has the most fart references so far. Yeah, I think. absolutely. So it's running down the length of my thighs, Sharon A. So Sharon A made him shit his pants. <laughs> All right, uh, fair but enough. You know, do you know what I think about my current bowel issues? What's that? I'm never going to stop. Oh no! Give it up. Oh please Such do. Such a dirty mind, Ooh. as well as a pair of kicks. Yeah, so Sharon A is giving him a dirty mind. And I oh, always dear. get it up for the touch of a younger kind. Oh, okay, so now it's a yeah. scat video. Yeah, it's getting it. Look, it's my, going my, back to my 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 my. <laughs> <laughs> That's awful. My 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 my, my Sharon A. <laughs> and the, uh, sorry, Sharon. what was that? My 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 Sharon A. I'm glad oh, you repeated it. Do you remember when you were a kid? Like, I do remember. You still ate, but I remember, remember when you were a kid. Yeah. Um. And did you? Like, I used to cry a lot when I was a kid. Okay. And sometimes when you'd finish crying, you're trying to explain yeah. why you've been crying. You go, I just want to do. <laughs> yeah, I think I probably did a bit, did a little bit of that. Yeah, yeah. I just want a baby beetle. Yeah. <laughs> my Sharon. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely, I get it. So, yes, yeah, so this is this is from an eight-year-old boy <laughs> in time travel. My Sharon. It's funny. So this is a time traveling kid. Time traveling kid. Time traveling kid with the shits called the knack. That's his name. That's his name, The Knack. Well, this song's by The Knack. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. fair enough. Fair yeah. enough. That's, his, that's his knack name. His na- <laughs> yeah. Nice. Well done. Well done. When are you going to give to me? Give to me. He's got Tourette's. <laughs> you know Tourette's. what? We shouldn't make fun of people with Tourette's nah, and other disabilities. Nah, yeah. Screw them. Yeah, no, that's fair enough. You know what? They put it out there. People make money off it off TikTok. Yeah. You know, stuff them. Give to me. Any excuse to swear at school. Yeah. I I've got Tourette's. Mm. Up, mm. Is it just a matter of time, Sharon A? Matter of well, it is a matter of time. You got a DeLorean. You got the whole thing ready to go. Everything in this song. Eighty eight miles an hour. I never knew this was a time travel song until tonight. Nor did I. I this is incredible. Was... You know what? I just thought it was a bit of a bit of a, a dirty song about a young woman. But turns out, no, it's time travel. Is this this is an adventure? <laughs> this is brilliant. We're uh, gonna. This is Back to the Future Four du, 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 with Sharon A and Sharon yeah. B and C because uh, Martin oh. McFly. Who's he? Uh, Martin McFly can't be in it. No. What, what's the Martin McFly actor? I can't remember his name. Michael J. Fox. Michael J. Fox. Well, he's got Parkinson's. He's not going to play a young uh, oh, Martin McFly anymore. No. So it's going to have to... All movies are getting remade with a female lead. So we put the female lead, Sharon A. You know what I realised? We've just done this whole podcast. Oh, no. What, what have we done? We've been making jokes about Michael J. Fox's Parkinson's. M- oh. m- m- <laughs> Oh no! That's not We're funny. in so much trouble. You know what? It's all right. Oh, I'm so sorry, Michael J. Fox. No, because Michael J. Fox uh, works in the Grated Cheese Department. Oh, stop it! Yeah. I thought he was. In the... I thought he was in the, on the laundry level, where he just sits in the bath all day and we throw our clothes. And clothes, and he, and he, yeah. yeah, and, yeah. Uh, he makes the suds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's a tattoo artist now. Is he? he well, is. No, <laughs> not a very good one. <laughs> anyway. Is it do, do, just do, 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 destiny? <laughs> if you don't, if you think I'm being silly, print the lyrics out yourself and yeah. read, read them. At home. This is because actually I'm, re- how it I'm goes. actually reading them. It is ju- just destiny. No, d- destiny. D- 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 destiny. Or is it just a game in my mind, Sharon? A. Eh? Oh, 
just a game. You know what that means? As well as the movie, yeah. this song is saying that Beauty Corp needs to bring out a game of Back to the Future. Oh the gosh. game version. No, the... but I won't do that. The board game. Oh, nice. I like it. We have been talking about a merch idea for a while. Boom, there it is. I love it. But I won't do that. The trivia board game. Oh. Yes, and we could uh, be like Trivial Pursuit. Exactly. Ask questions be- be- about be- levels of Beauty Corp. Uh, you, you got, yeah, you've got to up the levels of Beauty Corp, and it's kind of like some mousetrap thing comes down. Yeah. But but all of the answers for the questions about songs come from the podcast, not from nice. real life. Yeah. So you have to listen to the podcast to Ooh. answer the questions. Nice. That, I like that. That is the only thing that is stopping me from doing that is habitual laziness. It would be a lot to listen to the podcast and say, Just, uh, in what year did John and Grant leave? Um, I can't remember the name of the business we worked for. <laughs> <laughs> Rent-a-gent. Rent-a-gent. Yeah, I couldn't remember it. When yeah. did John and Grant leave Rent-a-gent? No. Who, ca- who cares? John doesn't even know. 1982. Yeah, it was 1982 because we're so old. We're so I old. You're, like, I was 10, but like... You're, you're I'm about, like a hundred years old. Yeah, you were like you were well into your eighties. Yeah, I, I am around a hundred years old yeah. now. And back yeah. in the eighties, I was eighty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how it worked. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. yeah. So now you because of time travel, because of the Delorean level five. Yeah. We I've got to say we have messed up the time timelines. Oh man, I don't know. It's I don't hard know. to keep track of. To be Loki honest with got you. nothing on us. No. No. Have you watched that? Have you watched Loki? No, I haven't watched Loki. Really good. Really. Really. really I don't think it's my it's cup a bit, of tea. No, it is. It's your, no, that's your cup of tea then. That's my cup of wine, which is empty now. Oh, no, it's empty. It's your fault. Um, is it d- d- Destiny or is it just a game in my mind, Sharon, eh? I'm never going to stop. Give it up. Such a dirty mind. I no, always I got... get it up for the touch of a younger kind. Oh, that's so dodgy. When it said never going to stop, ne- give it up, I thought it was going, never going to give you up. Never, never going to let, let you down. down. Never going to run around. And hurt you. Sorry, it was close. It was close to that. That's all the things Rick Astley wouldn't do, but what would he do? Would he do anything for love? He won't do that. He won't do that. We should Ooh. have a, we should, we should, You know, I nearly suggested tonight that we do that song. No. Grant Mullen, we took a vow. <laughs> we took a vow. I nearly suggested. Never to, to never, ever, ever. I can't even say the words, but we took a vow to never, ever. Know. You know the vow. I know. It yeah. Was, it was like Ooh, uh, I, I, thought, I thought we were going to reference it then. Whoa. No, no, we can't. No, we can't reference it because we took that other vow to say that we'd never reference the vow. Yes, that's right. Yeah, about the thing. Yeah, we can't ever do. That's right. And also, we, the one person we don't have under contract through Meat time life. travel is Meat Life. I know. So he, we we because we, we can, and we just can't. He's we, gone off. He has gone off. In that, the fridge. Yeah, oh, is that the smell? Yeah, and do you know why I never wanted Meat Loaf on staff? Why is that? Because, number one, he ruined the grand final that year, the AFL grand final. He did, yeah. He did. So he did. I'm punishing him. I'm banishing. I've banished him from the podcast. Oh, there's been such a mix-up. What? Because he was going to do that, and he said, John, I'm going to do such a beautiful job. We've been rehearsing for months and months. And I said to him, wouldn't it be funny if you just pretended to mess it up? You and did. He went, and he went, yeah, all right. Oh. And so and he, so it was just a big joke. Um, He's oh, a big oh no! All Australian sports fans are going to be so angry with me. Look, you know what? Let's just don't edit don't, that bit out. Don't tell them we did it. Yeah, that's fine. So anyway, my Sharona is a song about time travel and dirty-minded people that gets played at primary schools and Tourette's. It's a song about Tourette's, time yeah. travel. And um, looking into people's eyes. It's a mystery. Do you remember that quote you did in the last podcast? Which one? A real long one. When Interpersonal was... perception is psychoanalyzed as the psychological interest in decorative subversive of the homo sapien tendency to over dramatize the psychological influence of data. Was it that one? Have you got any others? Um, that is obsolete information, which may incur a detrimental formulation of my self concept. Хорошо живет на свете линий пух, от того поет он эти песни вслух. И неважно, чем он занят, если он худеть не станет, а ведь он худеть не станет, если, конечно, вовремя подкрепиться. Да. Трампа-рампа-пампа-рампа-пампа-пампа. Пум-пурумпа-пум-пурумпу-трампа-пампа. Пум-пурумпа-пум-пурумпум.
Хорошо живет на свете гений, фух! От того поет он эти песни вслух! И не важно, чем он занят, если он толстеть не станет! А ведь он толстеть не станет! Никогда! Да! Да!